What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to apply CyanogenMod theme engine themes to your stock Nexus. There's an impressive library of CM themes out there that are capable of theming the majority of Android's UI. Unfortunately though, these themes normally require that you have CyanogenMod or some other custom ROM installed. But if you're rooted with the Exposed Framework installed, you can apply a lot of these themes to your stock Nexus device. The Exposed module that makes this all possible is called HK Theme Manager and it was created by developer HDBK1986. So to get that installed, head to the download section of your exposed installer app and search HK Theme. Tap the top result, then swipe over to the versions tab and hit the download button on the most recent entry. Give that a second and the installer should automatically come up. Then hit the install button and when that's done, you'll get a notification from exposed telling you the module isn't activated and a reboot is needed. Just tap activate reboot here and Exposed will take care of the rest. Okay, so now that you're back up, you can begin installing some CM Theme Engine themes. These themes come in the form of APKs, or apps that you can install rather, and you can find many of them on the Play Store. But one limitation of HK Theme Manager is that some of these themes use XML files that the Exposed framework itself cannot apply. So CM themes that you download from the Play Store may or may not work with HK Theme Manager but the developer has ported a good 20 or so popular CM themes to give them full compatibility with his module. He's made these themes available on Google Drive, and I have a link for those in the full tutorial, which you can find at the link in the description below this video. So if you have the Google Drive app, which you should since it comes pre-installed on Nexus devices, then the process is pretty simple. Just pick out a theme, or even several themes, tap them, then let Google Drive do its thing. In a second here, the installer should come right up. So tap install here, then when it's finished, you can just hit done. Now if you head into HK Theme Manager, and grant it super user privileges obviously, you'll see the theme that you just installed. From here, hit apply, then on this next screen, tap set theme. You'll get a chance to choose which elements you'd like to have themed here, but all aspects of the theme are enabled by default. If you don't want something themed, you can just untick the corresponding box. But when you're done with all that, just hit Set Theme. After a few seconds, HK Theme Manager will tell you that a reboot is needed to apply the theme. So just hit Update Now, and that part will be done automatically. Okay, so after that second reboot, you can see the theme in effect. Like I said, these themes are pretty far-reaching, so a whole lot of elements have been themed. Status bars, navigation bars, apps, icons, menus, etc, etc. Really, a whole different look, honestly. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.